Hello my second verse. It's another unpacking video and from the background you can see it is all French. I'm wearing a France jersey and I got a parcel from France so I am very very excited about that one. Now the story behind this one is uh, I was about to order this myself. However, I uh, saw that the shipping would have cost like something crazy. Uh, how, how much? I think it was 15 euros or some, so, something like that, like, like that. And so I have a French acquaintance through YouTube. He has his channel, it's Idris. He has his channel, for Amour du Maillot. Something that you should check out. Yes, it's a great channel. Yes, it is all in French. Uh, if you have some knowledge of French, I have some re remaining knowledge. If I put the subtitles off, I can actually follow his, his channel. And he makes quite some interesting videos. I remember he made uh, a nice series about France's Nike jerseys, uh, which is pretty nice. Um, then about some, something about uh, French uh, jersey brands. So really interesting stuff in there. And, you know, another way of looking at jerseys which is always nice now idris has a favorite team and i want to get a jersey now if you have seen his channel you probably know already which uh, is and they had it on sale admittedly as, as you will see it's not the most uh how to say straightforward looking jer uh, jersey but um it fits one of the cat categories that i have I wanna have a jersey kind of from every at least foreign town that I've visited. So kind of if they have a decent football team. So it fit the category and knowing that he's a fan, I thought, yeah, let's contact him and maybe he uh, has a way of shipping it to me cheaper because uh, da da da. And he kindly offered to get the jersey for me uh, and also for a cheaper Shipping, I think he offered me even the free shipping to Austria, so I had only to pay the in France shipping, which I'm really, really, really thankful for. This uh, was an amazing offer, especially to get a very special jersey. Now, uh, this team at the moment is a Ligue 2 team, and I have already two Ligue 2 teams, current Ligue 2 teams, uh, up there, which I find uh, a gut 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 thing. I mean, with this jersey, now I think that's the French. Tier club teams are, the, the, uh, or, or France is the country of most uh, under uh, teams that are not top tier at the moment, which is kind of odd, but also cool and nice. Italy, I currently have only two. Um, Spain, I have one. So yeah, France, this will be three. And I also have to say, before I open this now up, and uh, I've, I, I, I'll sort of be very, very careful here because it's rel relatively tightly packed. So I am heeding that warning uh, with my scissors here because it, you gotta be, I don't wanna cut another. I made once a small cut into a jersey. I don't wanna repeat that experience, <laughs> to be honest. So have to be really, really, really care careful here. Yes, I avoided it. I avoided the cut, so let's slowly slowly move this up uh what i wanted to say is that i actually think that among all the leagues that are out there uh league R might be the most underrated for um collectors but it is a league that has amazingly great jerseys of over it might actually be now that i'm looking at jerseys it might actually be my second favorite yes there are some teams that have rather straightforward ones um but then there are so many uh, unique and special teams in there. I mean, three iconic designs right off the, off the bat. You have the um, Chevron by um, Bordeaux. I don't have a Monaco jer uh, jersey with the classic diagonal uh, look. Then you have the classic PSG look. So um, then the off center stripe from Lyon, which they don't use, use it often. So I mean, there, there are quite some interesting and kind of remarkable. I also think that the non color scheme is rather cool. Now, before I take this shirt uh, out, I also want to note that there's a reason why I put those small teams, the two Ligue 2 teams up there that I have, because, yeah, this is a Ligue 2 team. Now, let's see. I have here a little order sheet. Very good. I will look at that. And here is the shirt already. I'm looking for some that. This is the shirt. I can tell you off the bat before I show it to you. Uh, all the main club logos are applied like a plastic transfer. 
and the rest is all printed on which is something that I start to appreciate more and more. Ready for the big reveal? I guess you are. I've been talking five minutes giving stuff away. The team that I have is of course SMK, uh, Stade Malherbe, uh, Ducan. Um, I know I, you, if, if you saw the one when I started doing jer jersey rules, they were just in league and got relegated. Um, but I said I really love the crest. I get it. I mean, I look, I looked at the crest, his, his history, and then I recalled, yeah, they had quite some nice uh, older ones. And I get it that this might not be very pop popular with the fans, but I have, I have to say that it's, it's, it's kind of strong looking, to, to be honest. Now the jersey itself uh, is really a. Um, kind of wacky one it took me a while to look to look to look at it and get you use it because the red striping fades in, in in and out but kind of counter so it goes red to blue and uh here uh, blue to red but what, what i really like is kind of a knitted look to it which is really really nice of course tons of sponsors which i would expect from a french jersey i even like it that i have the Sleeve sponsors here, really nice, re re uh, really nice. Um, yeah, Ligue 2 patch would have been, but you know, it's not a big deal. Uh, the back is plain, but what I really like here is that there are the two lions uh, from the Normand flag, which is of course very, very similar to what the English has. And of course, there we have a Normand ship as well from a, a team based in Normandy. I wouldn't expect anything more. So, uh, yes. Lots of sponsors. I really love it. I absolutely love this jersey. Uh, the, it, it has a special feel to me. Uh, it has here a nice uh, tag, Normands et Conquerants, meaning Normans uh, and Conquerors. So uh, really playing into the history of that region. And the Normandy is uh, actually a really nice region. I have, I have, have to say I was there, I think, over now 20 years ago, but I really enjoyed uh, the area there, so uh, really nice, quite happy to have this one. Uh, nice work by Umbro, I have to say, once again, uh, and uh, quite a special shirt. Uh, we were discussing, I mean, the current home jersey is really, really be beautiful, like classic jer uh, jersey, and if I was a fan uh, of the team, I really would go for that one. Their last season's away jersey was an absolute beauty with red and a blue cross and a wonderful sponsor up there. Uh, not as clunky as this one, a kind of similar one. Uh, this season they have uh, the same one in black and gray, which looks nice, uh, but I thought that last season looks better. But I told Idris that actually now that I am collecting jer uh, jer jerseys, the red and the blue stripes are very well covered by my Barcelona collection. And so going for a little bit something more out there is actually something that I like doing. And yes, it took me a while to get used to that one. But now I really love this jersey. There is something really cool about it. Yes, again, it took me a while to get uh, to, to, to get used to it. So quite ha happy about it. Also what I'm happy about it, I don't know if they played in that one, but uh, they were about to get really relegated to the third tier. And on the last day, it uh, was kind of an exciting finish where they managed to stay in Ligue 2. And I hope they will stay there and maybe even get promoted up to Ligue 1 again. So yeah, let me know what you think about this jersey. I am really happy to have it. And now I can fill in very nicely all slots with all French teams if I need it, if I need it to. And yeah, three Ligue 2 teams at the, at, at, at the moment. In any case. Let me know what you think about the, the, this one. I, I know it's out there, but I, to, I totally love it. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Again, merci beaucoup, Idris. I'm really, really uh, thankful to you for helping me get this shirt because it is really awesome to have now one of your favorite teams as well. And with that, give me a like if you want to see more. Um, um, or subscribe to my channel if you want to see more uh, videos like this. And I will definitely talk to you soon. Bye. I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated on all the things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day.